In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to simplify micro via arrays into single individual vias during import. For this sample, we have a GDS file that contains this spiral. So it's a spiral that runs around, goes down with a micro via array to a bridge, and then back up with another micro via array, and then back around again. So if I zoom in here, you'll see that those those vias are actually microvia arrays. So over 400 vias in each of these. When we import this into Sonnet, we really want to just have one via for each of the two via arrays. So I'm going to show you how to do that. So let's close off these two and import our GDS file. Select File, Import, GDS. Select our file. I'm going to change the name of this file that I'm going to import it into just so I don't delete a file that I already have. Select Next. We're going to just choose the default structure. Press Next. And here are the streams that are in that GDS file. 3, 4, and 6. Number 4 is our via, is the stream with the vias. I'm going to change the layer, the level numbers. So our vias are going to go from 1 to 2. And the other two levels will be 1 and 2. And we'll give our metals a name. We'll just use gold for each of them. And press next. Now we press Options. Alright, here's what we need to do. The Simplify via Arrays. We want to turn that on. The Array Options, these are all the parameters that control how the algorithm works. The algorithm needs to go out and find all the vias and decide which ones belong together in a single array and this, these settings here control how that happens. You can press the help button to learn more about them later. Okay, all we need to do now is push OK and import. So it says it took 882 vias and created two simple single via arrays out of it. Push close, zoom in, and we see that it did in fact create two single vias. The other thing that it did that's important is that it created two metal types, one for our planar, our regular planar traces, and also one for those arrays. And it used the via metal type called array, which means that this was had come from a via array simplification. It set the conductivity to infinity because we didn't tell it whatever. We could go in and type in the infinite the conductivity for gold here. To accurately simulate the via array as a single via, Sonic calculates this fill factor, which is the percentage of the area that the original micro via is covered by the new single via. So that's all there is to uh, running the via simplification feature while importing from GDS. We also have the same checkbox for when you import from DXF or Gerber and the interfaces from the frameworks also have the same feature. So I hope you learned something about via simplification. For more quick tip and training videos please visit sonnetsoftware.com video